Hey everyone, what's going on? Welcome to the channel and thank you so much for taking your own time out to click on this movie review. Today's movie is The Old Way, which is releasing on January 6th in theatres, but thanks to Saban Films, I got an early screener to check this one out. So it's directed by Brett Donahue and it stars Nicolas Cage and Ryan Kira Armstrong in Nicolas Cage's first Western movie. So I was very intrigued for this because Nicolas Cage has certainly had kind of like a career revival within the last couple of years or so in movies such as The Unbearable Weight of Mass and Talent and Pig just for an example so he's kind of really become more of a known name once again than just like directed DVD movies kind of slump that he went through in a little while of his career so this movie I was interested in the movie the poster I was sent I was like wow cool Nicolas Cage I'm a fan of so I was on board and the plot of this movie is essentially around like an old gunslinger and his daughter have to face the consequences of a man who is hunting them down as Nicolas Cage, the old gunslinger, killed his father several years ago. And yeah, they've now got to face the consequences of that action. So already you've kind of got like a high stakes plot going into this movie. And Nicolas Cage being in a western. So what can I overall say about this movie? It had potential, uh, for sure. Unfortunately, it kind of goes back to the DVD slump era of Nicolas Cage. Now, it's not to say that he's bad in this movie or anything, because he isn't. Him and Ryan Keir Armstrong are great. Ryan Keir Armstrong was in Firestarter from last year, and definitely the best part of that movie. And Nicolas Cage is great in pretty much anything that he does. He certainly kind of hams it up a little bit in this role, and with the accent that he's putting on here. I really enjoyed the element between those two and the chemistry and the relationship that we get between this father and daughter and what kind of consequences it can lead up to into that kind of like a final showdown which I'll not spoil for you guys but I definitely felt that throughout the movie the western era of this as well I love a western era movie I've slowly been getting into more of them over the last couple of years especially I can really say that they don't really add too much here uh, the cinematography is really nice to look at for sure and it's well shot and everything which I can only give praise to so it's a very kind of pretty movie to look at in terms of like a well polished kind of western. It doesn't really have that kind of like grittiness to the kind of tone of western movies and the style that they have uh, but in terms of like a different interpretation it, it works well in terms of that regards. Uh, but this movie overall, it's an hour and 35 minutes long, so it's not really like a very, very long movie or anything either. But there was odd times I found myself a little bit bored here. I kind of wish that the story progression happened a little bit more. I wish that there was even more stakes in this movie, because I feel like at times they touch on being like really high stakes. Like kind of one or two false moves and like, like wow, that's, you know, something bad's really going to happen. At times, yeah, it does, but I, I just felt like there was nothing really too much here to kind of like latch onto. I feel like this could have definitely been done better but unfortunately this one doesn't quite work and I had high hopes for it as well but yeah ultimately it didn't work for me. So my overall score for The Old Way is a two stars out of five. Have you seen this movie? Are you going to go check it out? I'll leave any and all comments down below so we can continue the discussion down there. If you've enjoyed this review, give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel if you already haven't by clicking the red button down below. Also, if you're unaware, I do have a Patreon. I have a couple of tiers you can select from, which starts from £2 per month. And these tiers do include like early videos, my release schedules, and see what goes on to the channel. You can actually pick out movies for me to review. There's so much stuff to find out about my Patreon. The link is down below in the description box if you want to check out more. And I want to give a big special thank you to all my awesome Patreons who help support the channel. So thank you so much for clicking on to this video. Thank you for watching. And until the next time that I see you, I'll be seeing you later.